OPM, which is other people's money, or OPC, which is other people's credit, right? Don't leverage your own money and don't leverage your own credit if you don't have to, guys. But let me show you how to do this without any risk and make the maximum amount of profit. There are 10 different prefab homes you can purchase that are perfect for short-term rentals, but not getting played by the companies that are selling them is harder than a virgin in a strip club on Viagra that's never had a lap dance before. Welcome back, my name is Kerry, and today I'm gonna to show you the top 10 prefab homes of the year. This is one of my favorite videos to make of the entire year because it's a look back at everything that happened in the industry over the last 12 months which was a lot. This year I made over 100 videos about prefab homes and I still feel like we're just getting warmed up in the industry. Bef now he's not lying about that. Prefab homes have been trending and a lot of people are making a lot of money off of in it, which is why I had to correct a few things in here and give you guys another option, but let's keep going. Before I go Rick D's on the list, a quick thank you to everyone who took the time to comment on videos this year. Uh -huh. I'm more into Ellen's new show than I ever was the old one. You rocking term rocking Terminator shades, bro. Seer, heartfelt, to the point. I like that. Okay, let's start. Let's As always, the criteria for making the top 10 list is extremely stringent. In order to qualify, a home must be a home that I like. It's a very scientific approach. To kick things off, we're going to the West Coast to check out a home from Orca LGS. Orca is a dynamic global construction company disrupting traditional thinking and challenging inefficiencies in the industry. They use an innovative integrated digital platform to design, manufacture, and assemble light gauge steel pod structures. There are a couple things I really like about what they're doing over at Orca. First, I like the look of the homes they're putting out. They've got a West Coast vibe with a combination of metal siding and wood accent that it looks great. So over there on the West Coast, you might want to do a little bit of research. But remember, we're not watching this for the reasons that he put this out there. Our whole goal is to find these prehab homes that are these prefab homes that can be used for a short term rental business, guys. You don't want to do uh, flipping. You don't want to put this purchase up and do all of that extra stuff because don't forget how pricey it is. First, when you order these, you got to uh, um, you have to also have the slab of concrete ready for you have to deal with plugging up of all the utilities and everything like that. What we teach you in copy paste rentals as on the screen behind me, we show you how to find these people that have already recently purchased these prefab homes and uh, you can make a lot of income on it passively uh, just by partnering with them. OK, so they already have the home. That's the supply. You're going to create the demand like how I teach you in the course that I'm going to show you a little bit later. Second, I really like the idea of their pop-up factory. They have the flexibility to pop up a factory and manufacture their homes right out of development, which they say outperforms both traditional methods and centralized factory. So that means is the supply is uh, fluid, okay? So it's gonna be a lot of these out there in abundance. So if you're worried about competition, guys, there is no competition. This is the new way that homes are getting built now. Like it's efficient uh, for time and cost, right? So a lot of people are ditching the old methods of getting your home built from scratch and everything like that, and they're going to this. But they, we're not here for you to build a house or anything. We are scouting the type of properties you guys can get good rental income from. So let's keep going. Across all key performance categories, from cost controls to completion timelines. In their pop-up factory, they can build homes from their pod line to ship to other destinations, as well as building homes for the development. It's almost like a hybrid approach that gives them the best of both worlds. Even though they're located in Courtney, BC, Canada, Orca recently announced their pod line will be available in Washington, Oregon, California, and Nevada. Which is an exciting bit of news for any the home more resistant to ember, to ember attacks and bushfire. Okay, so what he's explaining is cool and everything, but I want us to skip to the good part. Let's get to the meat and the potatoes. You can find out all of that stuff if you decide to purchase it. To do the copy and paste rental business model, this is service arbitrage slash drop servicing the real estate where you find these people that already have purchased these, but they don't know how to monetize them yet. Even if they have Airbnb listings, they don't have any reviews, nobody's booking or anything like that. So we provide a service that allows them to split the recurring income the monthly income with us and we don't have to do any of this building or buying stuff that he's talking about which may or may not be a concern depending on 
actually delivering homes to customers by the name of Zenny Home. I've been following Zenny Home for a couple of years now and it is always exciting to see ideas come to life and customers receiving homes. Zenny Home was founded in to the housing industry shortage by designing and factory building its models to be easily transported to have minimum environment environmental in the home. Zenny Home has a substantial wait list or wait list for their homes in two months. I stopped by to see what they were up to earlier this year and looking back out of everything I saw, the layout that stood out to me was their Nordic Plus. The Nordic Plus has a footprint of 395 square feet in which they've got one bedroom, one bathroom and a loft. The base price is currently set at 57,000 euros for their comfort configuration and they've got models on either end of that price point depending on what people are looking for. What a Okay, so for that model right there, $56,000 is not bad. It will make a lot of money on Airbnb if you know what you're doing. And this is where we come in, guys. These people don't know what they're doing. They will purchase this and they will just sit it out there and put a for rent sign in the yard or, or post in Facebook groups and show people pictures or ask friends or call a realtor, which is even worse, right? we know how to use the copy and paste rental business model for service arbitrage copy and paste right we will be able to bring them bookings consistently book to capacity you understand what i'm saying most about the nordic plus was the high ceiling as a background in hospitality and their models are geared to that industry however that doesn't mean they can't be purchased by anyone who likes what they've That's got nice going idea. on for me the big standout head turning feature is their exteriors they've got a natural cypress exterior cladding and black trim that looks fantastic they do have one and two bedroom options but the one i saw was the studio villa the studio villa has good flow that wraps around from the back entrance through the kitchen into the living space which has multiple different areas i really before don't like finally studio. arriving in the bathroom let's not forget about the big sliding glass door and windows on the front that look great from the inside looking out and outside looking at the outside. The Tomu Villa is currently listed at 145,000 and they're taking orders for 2024. In okay, that one's crazy right there. Now, $144,000, I'm not sure if that's worth it for me, but I guess if you are a master of monetization like we teach you to be, then you can make your money back in a decent amount of time for it to feel like it's worth it, guys, especially if you didn't spend any money out of pocket. If you use OPM, which is other people's money, or OPC, which is other people's credit, right? Don't leverage your own money and don't leverage your own credit if you don't have to, guys. But let me show you the real way to do this, how to do this without any risk and make the maximum amount of profit. So when you go to the first pinned comment, it's going to bring you here to copy and paste rentals.com where our students are getting monetized. They're making money within the first seven days uh, and we guarantee 14 days. Right. OK, so it says if you don't hit your first one to three K in your first 14 days using the same business model as Airbnb, Toro, DoorDash and Uber, Uber and copy and paste rentals will pay you for every assignment successfully completed. It. All right. If you look at the testimonials and everything, you'll see that our students get results within 24 to 48 hours, typically when they apply action and it's endless. So now let me give you the preview like I promised inside the copy and paste rentals course. So once you get inside there, there's only 97 bucks. We used to choose. Uh, we used to charge uh, $2,000 for that. OK, once you get in there, you have the option. All right. For party bus rental business, you can start a party bus rental. We have a lot of winners in there making a lot of money fairly fast. You can choose the uh, vacation home rental business, the service or arbitrage, what we're talking about with the homes and everything. Uh, you can choose the yacht rental business where you can book a yacht rental. Well, a customer will book a yacht rental for like $18,000 just for a week or just for a weekend, right? This type of stuff, high ticket. Okay. Or you can do the exotic car rental. So check this out. We have the uh, copy and paste rental business, which a lot of people choose this. And um, you can pretty much see everything that's inside that course right there. Then we have the uh, yacht rental business right here. Super high ticket. Don't get intimidated, but this is where you meet the stars. You understand? increase your net worth by increasing your net work okay then we have the copy and paste vacation rentals course which is going to show you what we're talking about with the homes and everything like that that we were just looking at then we have 
the uh, car rental business model uh, where there's regular cars, you know, SUVs and all of that extra stuff and exotic car rentals, $2,000, $3,000 per day if you want to level up. What you guys should do is if you want to cash in, you have to put in action. Don't hesitate. All right. Procrastination is the father of failure. You go to the first pin comment. I don't know how much longer it is going to be ninety seven dollars because, like I said, we were charging over two K for this. It's definitely worth over 10 grand. Right. Especially how many students are getting crazy amounts of results, guys.